welcome back to my channel today I am back with a brand new and exciting video it's all about the basket bag or straw bags or worker bags that you need for the summertime and this video is also my collection of basket bag that I have so far I'm sure I will be adding some more to my collection as summer approaches I am just obsessed with basket bags um, I don't know it's just in my DNA somehow Perhaps it's because I am Haitian and growing up, my aunts used to go to the market with, you know, their little pannier or basket bags. And um, so that's probably why I have this kind of like a love affair with basket bag. And I just think they just add like a flair of, I don't know how to, to say it, but I don't know, you just add this flair to your summer dress, wardrobe, or your outfit. Just just said that I am effortless, you know, I'm effortless. I am not trying too hard. I am just, you know, chic naturally. I don't know. That's how I feel about basket bags. I just love them so much. I have so many. I cannot stop buying them. Again, we are getting ready for summer. Again, I believe the summer, like we should make the summer count. We should make this one of the best summers out there, you know, because most of us did not really enjoy last year. So I think this year we need to go ahead and just, you know, get out there and just have some fun. Safety, of course. So I am wearing this um sunflower necklace from daisy jewelry i love daisy and my top it's called the brie crab blouse i love the um what do you call this the shearing detail here the elastic detail and the balloon sleeves i love this blouse so much i think it's just like it's so romantic i'm obsessed with it and my skirt is from anthropology that was from November, so I don't know if the skirt is still available. I am sorry, but I love it so much. It's stuck in this rosy color. It's so pretty. It's so feminine, so chic. My earrings are from Susan Shaw. They're like the rose pearl earrings. On my lip, I have Ashton by ABH. I believe that is it. So yes, as I said, this is my collection of straw bag and also some of the best basket bags that I think you need for the summertime. So first thing first, let's start with one that is um very affordable this one is from amazon i got this one last summer i've been on the lookout for one like this what i really really love about this one it's like the perfect size it's like a medium size it's perfect to go to the market it's also perfect to pair with all your cute summer dresses it's perfect to go to the beach but um to me this is more of a market or like everyday running errand around the city kind of basket bag for me and the bigger attractor to this one is the the strap over here because most basket bags don't come with a strap and after a while it does you know if you put a lot of stuff in there like i do it becomes heavy to carry around but at the same time i just think it's just like the cutest thing to just carry around but I think everyone needs one of those, the one that has a strap, especially if you are running errands around the city, you are going to buy stuff to just put in there. Or if you're just going to the market, you know, let's say you live in New York City or you live somewhere where you go to the market every Saturday, you can actually just take this bag with you and then you can just buy your fruits and veg and just put them in there. I just think it's like the cutest thing ever. And again i really really love to have the strap because the straps just make it so versatile to the point where you can pop it over here when it gets a little bit too heavy and um and oh let me tell you guys about this this is from lindsay albani's i hope i'm saying that correctly this is like a hat um catcher so especially if you're like myself you wear a lot of hats um I highly suggest you get one of these things because I always get, you know, run into trouble somewhere when I get inside and I need somewhere to put my hat and then, you know, you end up like having to hold your hat all the time. So if you don't have to think about that problem, I highly, highly recommend you get you one of these. I actually just got a brand new one. It's a raffia one, which is going to match my basket bags and then I am going to be putting this with my leather bags instead. 
again i just think if you're a lot of like hats you need one of those like these are just like so perfect to have around so that way when you're done with your hat you just put it in there and then they just like keep it there but let's get back to the basket bag again i just think basket bag was just like so chic they are so perfect to go with all your summer wardrobe i do think like every fashion girl or everyone really needs um a basket bag especially for the beach or the market i really really love this so this one is from etsy and then i believe this is under 50 dollars. i think i paid 30 dollars for this i don't remember but i will be linking everything below so you can check it out another one that i ordered with this one is um is actually this this one is tiny bit bigger but what i really really love about this one is this kind of like this full leather like handles I think the full leather handles just add a little bit more chicness to it where um, you can actually pair it with your outfit. Um, although you can take this to the market as well. But again, I really, really think the full leather strap just add a little bit of chicness to this um, to the point where you can actually pair it with any outfit. I love this one. Again, I think this one will probably be like everyday running errands and more going to the market and the beach for me but that's because i have so many basket bags so i have like different categories on what i take where but again that's because i am not so for a basket bag it's so funny i would rather carry a basket bag than like a chanel bag any day i don't know like basket bags are just like they makes me they makes me so happy i don't know and now let's move on to the designer basket bags when it comes to designer basket bag one of the most famous basket bag out there is the Loewe. I actually convinced so many of my friends to get this bag. Um, so many of them got, got it. And honestly, it's just like, yeah, when it comes to designer basket bag, this is the one. If you had to pick one for kind of like every day, then I would highly recommend the Loewe. The reason why I recommend the Loewe in the size medium, this is a size medium. And, um, as I said, the reason why I recommend this one is because this one, the strap, you can pop it over your shoulder. And they are also adjustable where you can actually make it shorter if you just want to just wear it um, on your hands. And also, I just think that Loewe plaque right here, just give it, and also the strap, the leather strap, just give it such a more of a like chicer look where you can actually dress this up. This, I just, we're not going on vacation honestly i don't even need to go on vacation around the city all year long not really all year long all summer long even in the fall i carry this bag i typically stop carrying this bag i would say around like november when it gets like you know like dead into the winter but up until then i carry this bag almost every day um like everywhere i go I take it on vacation with me everywhere I go. If it's warm, I love this bag. This is one of my best investments. It's one of my favorite bags that I've purchased. Maybe at the end of the video, I will pick out three of my um, favorites or I'll just probably pick my top three or top five, like if you had to go for one. So if you had to go for like a designer one, this is the one that I would recommend. This is one of my favorite ones out there. I just think it's just like the chic as It literally goes with everything in your wardrobe. They also have this in an orange color and also the white. I thought that I wanted the white, but then again, when I thought about it, I was like, you know what? I don't want it to be Loewe again. Although I would not mind this in the white, to be quite honest. I don't know. I may end up getting the white one i don't know the big one like the bigger size in the white plaque because i do think um you know if i'm going on a boat date all day i could just like put everything in there and just put all my camera equipment in there as well um but this one is just like perfect for me it's a perfect size again that's the one that i carry all the time i can talk about this for like hours and hours i cannot recommend this enough I yeah I'm obsessed with this again I've had literally all my friends buy this because it's the best one and the next best ones when it comes to designer basket bag it's the Chloe Marcy and this one again the leather trimming over here and also in the handle just make it so chic and so dressy where you can actually dress it up this is the most this is the most dressy in terms of this size of bag that I have 
and I really really love the off-white again when I was thinking about getting the Louis Vuitton in the white but I, I thought to myself I don't want the same one I should probably look around to see and then Chloe came out with this I was like oh actually this is the one that I was waiting for so this is really really perfect and um, I love that it has this little pocket over here especially if you're me you're always looking for your um, keys you can find them it's a great pocket to have um, and this is what it looks on the inside this the quality of this basket bag is amazing it's ridiculous this is such better quality then the Loewe, I would say, they're about the same, but this one looks and feels a lot much better quality. Maybe it's because I've had this for longer and I've worn it everywhere. So that's probably what that is. This bag, like if this one kind of like goes bad, I would just go and repurchase another one like right away. That's how much I'm obsessed with this bag. Like I cannot get enough of this. And this one is again, this is so perfect for when I wear my, you know, white um, Hermes sandals. So this goes really, really well with that. And again, I, I think um, if you are a fan of straw bag like myself, I do think that you need one in the white as well. And this is perfect. And Chloe just came out with this kind of like green color and it's so gorgeous. And I'm thinking about adding that green color to my wardrobe because, um, I don't know it's very unique it's something that i think most people will probably go for the off-white or this one comes in the in the tan color as well so i think most people will probably gravitate towards those colors because you're more classic but i do think that green is just like so pretty it's so unique so i think i may add it to my wardrobe it will be something fun especially since i wear a lot of white dresses it'll be something fun so the two that i recommend for um in terms of designer basket bags are these two the Loewe and the 10 color and then the Chloe and the white color um I think Celine came out with one as well I really like the Celine one I almost bought the Celine actually when I was thinking about which one to go for I ended up um, getting the Chloe instead because I really really love the Chloe so we'll see which one that I go for this summer because I know I will be adding another one and another one that if you go to Mexico, you need to get one of those. I got this in Tulum um, a few years ago. And this is one of my favorite ones because, again, it's very unique. Not everyone is going to have this. Like, look at this. It's so, so unique. Um, it's so, so pretty. And what I love about this also, it has this Velcro thing here. Because the bad thing about basket bags sometimes, it's open. I think people don't like that that's what i love about basket bag because you're like open i like things where they're not too structured in the way i love things that are just like i don't know just like fun and just you know effortless i can just throw everything in there and then i just get it out so that's what i love um like personally i don't want everything to have like structure and stuff like that that's just me i guess because maybe it's because my life have been so structured as a kid that I despise like orderly so much but um, again I love that this one has a velcro in there um, if you want like a basket bag that is secure highly recommend and also the handle it's round it's so pretty I love this this is so so unique I take this with me um, every time if I'm going like on a beach vacation I'm obsessed with this the stitching is white on this is really 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 beautiful again if you are into loom i think i paid like 300 or 400 pesos for this it's so so beautiful it's so gorgeous i love this so much this is one of my favorite basket bags ever i cannot get over this and i will always cherish this basket bag the next one is the moroccan basket bag it is the round one that everyone was spotting back in like 2016 or 2017 when Morocco was like the destination and everyone had this basket bag and when I went to Morocco of course I had to have it again like this is so unique it's so cool I really really love this um this you can use it as decoration you can hang it in your kitchen or living room um this is not my style when it comes for like decor I wouldn't do that I just love it as a basket bag to just you know carry this carries so much stuff like it's very deep you can carry so much stuff you can carry change of clothes 
so this is one of my favorite ones that I got in Morocco. I love it so much. I think I bought like four of them or something like that. So along this line, the one from Morocco, they also had it in a small size. And I thought I would get the small size. So this would be kind of like the day one. And then this would be kind of like the night one that I would take out. I know I probably overdo it when it comes to basket bag, but... I can't get enough. Once I get one size, I'm like, oh, I need a smaller size also. And I feel like Morocco in the Medina, it's just kind of like basket bag heaven. I don't know. I would love to have a line of basket bag um, someday. So maybe I need to get working on that because it's my style. I just love basket bags so much. I just cannot get enough of them. And the next one are just kind of like more regular basket bag. This is another favorite that I got last summer. This is from Hat Attack and omg like this one is just so incredibly beautiful like oh my goodness i love this one so much i really really love the weaving and i love how much you can see on the inside with this i really really love this and also the shape of this because most basket bags tend to just be kind of like that shape but this one i just love it it's more like um like a rectangle this one has a little bit of structure to it but at the same time in back skid bag terms which make this a little bit more on the chic and classy side so i think like this you can dress it up this i can actually wear like a zimmerman dress um actually i can wear a zimmerman dress and pair it with any of those basket bags i don't really care but um i do think this can just be paired with a very very chic and classy bag i i mean classy outfit I really really love this and I feel like I can also um, pair this this wouldn't be a beach bag for me personally this is more like a going to a picnic wedding errands kind of bag I really really love this let me get closer so you can see this this is one of my favorite basket bags ever again this is from hat attack hopefully it's still available I will link it below Another one that I got from Hat Attack. Ooh, I know I'm missing another one from Hat Attack. I have another one from Hat Attack that has wine, um, that rhinestone on it. Um, I will insert the picture of that one from Hat Attack. I've definitely taken a picture of it so you can see. So those two bags from Hat Attack, which is this one and the other one that I don't know where I misplaced it somewhere. These were like my two kind of like going out at night bags. Like in the summertime, I avoid leather bag like the plague. Um, it's very rare that you will catch me in wearing like carrying a leather bag in the summertime. It's just not my thing. Um, I'm again basket bag. It's where my soul is. So I was looking for like cute little ones that I could take out with me. The the more chic that I can wear with like a very nice like dressy dress at night. And when I found this, I was like, actually this is perfect. And then the other one from Hat Attack, which I'll post a picture on the screen over here so i think this is like the perfect one this holds like a really really good amount of things in there um it's like perfect to put all your stuff and then it has a white or i would say more of like a linen or like oatmeal color lining on the inside and you can even close it if you want to but i don't i just you know enter the lining um all the way in and just dump everything that i need in there so when I go out at night in the summertime, if it's somewhere that is like super like classy classy, this is the one that I would take with me because I think it's super chic. Or if I'm going to a really nice meal during the day where I don't need to carry a big bag, I need to carry like, I want to carry small bags, then I will go with this one. I really, really love this. Um, so yes, this is one of my favorite ones. And speaking of dressy, another basket bag, which I think everyone needs in the wardrobe. I've placed this in a box because to me now, it's part of my kind of like gallery collection in a way. I hardly wear this bag, but if I was to go to a summer wedding, this is the basket bag that I would carry or I would carry this one. So it would either be this or it will be the cult gaia this is the bag that just put cult gaia on the map i got this bag i think four years ago when it was trending actually i got it like a year later um when it was trending so this is the famous arc bag by the cult gaia again it's that is the bag that put them in the map 
and I just think that this bag will never go out of style like this bag will always be in style so I would still highly highly recommend you get it um, it's a bag to have in your collection like how stunning but again this is a famous art bag again this is a bag that I think everyone needs in the wardrobe this is very classy it's very chic again I just think like if you are invited to a summer wedding this is the bag that you should carry or um, as I said before or the other one that I would carry is this little one but the call guy out would be my first choice I I am utterly obsessed with this bag it's a piece of art. I just cannot stop looking at it. This is part of my gallery now where I don't necessarily carry this. I haven't worn this in like two years now. I haven't worn this in two years because I'm kind of like saving it and treating it kind of like a baby. Because I'm just saving this for like a special occasion or like a special moment really. So... Yeah, the art bag by Cold Gaia, you absolutely need it in your wardrobe. Another bag that I have to show you are like probably some of my favorite ones. They're actually the Jane Birkin basket bag. Everyone, well, I wouldn't say everyone needs a Jane Birkin basket bag. It doesn't go with everyone's style. So a bag that goes with everyone's style is probably just like the regular basket bag. But for someone like myself, I am obsessed with the Jane Birkin basket bag. Jane Birkin is actually one person that, um, I don't know, kind of like fend the flames for my love for basket bag again because I went years where I was trying to be kind of like trendy and stuff like that. Um, trying to get into designer and then it turns out like it wasn't really my thing. Um, and then I kind of like fell in love with basket bags again and then... Um, I was on the lookout for the Jin Birkin basket bag for the longest time. So the Jin Birkin basket bag is one of the most iconic basket bags out there because Jin Birkin kind of put basket bags on the map. If you don't know who Jin Birkin is, Google her. Um, she's English. She's an English actress, singer, but she actually spent most of her time in France, um, Paris. So she has, you know, that Parisian style and so on, which is that effortless. So she kind of put this basket back on the map because Jen Birkin used to be the kind of girl. She's in a ball gown. She's wearing this basket bag. Like, that's the bag that, you know, she's carrying. And the Birkin bag from Hermes is named after her because one day she was on a flight and she had her basket bag, of course. And I guess she put it on, over the the compartment and then when they opened it everything fell and she was sitting next to one of the people that work at Hermes the designers and so on so and then they decided to like you know work together on a bag she's like why don't I make you a bag where you know when you're traveling your stuff doesn't fall out so that's how the Birkin bag from Hermes was born so that's a famous Birkin bag um so yes if you want to read the story i mean go for yourself it's on youtube and so on but again i love the jen birkin basket bag i remember that summer i was looking for one everywhere i couldn't find one and then i walked into urban outfitters and i saw this one i found this for like 30 dollars or even less than that i was like oh my god i've just been looking for the jen birkin basket bag and i found it i was so obsessed although it wasn't the perfect jen birkin basket bag but of course i settled for it i was like you know what i'll just have this for now until i can find the perfect jane birkin basket bag so since that i've just been looking and been looking and last summer i think i found one that is very close to the jane birkin bag and this one again i can never get rid of it because it's kind of like my initial birkin um birkin basket bag but i managed to find this one from etsy love i'm obsessed like i think this is truer than what the Birkin basket bag looks like I love this you know to go to a nice picnic just to go to the park and just carry this with a nice little dress in the summertime it's so romantic I love it you can even decorate with this honestly just put like a bouquet of flowers and have it you know sit somewhere in your house again I am obsessed with this Again, I'll be linking everything below if you ladies are interested in these. I am a Jane Birkin kind of girl. Again, I don't think the style works for everyone's style. But for me, 
because my style is a little bit more French and effortless and casual chic so I just think it just works really well with my style again I am obsessed with the Jane Birkin bag um again this is my original one but this is like what I feel like it's truest or the closest to what the real Birkin basket bag was I can't wait to get my Birkin bag though <laughs> although when I get my Birkin bag I'm probably gonna be wearing this one a lot more than that Birkin bag and the next bag that I have to show you is Caillou is another brand that makes this on the designer spectrum of basket bags I got this a few years ago um, for the Caillou one I love them because I do think when I get married they have this one that's called bright to be so they have those kind of like um, they personalize them in a way not necessarily personalize them but you know they have the writing on them so this one says Abrecy which I love I just hate that pom pom is covering that so I wish the pom pom was somewhere else although I can remove it but it really doesn't go anywhere else I think in my opinion so it just like stays here because it kind of like covers the C but this is such a cute one again um, the quality of this one wasn't the best but it's a few years I still have it I hardly ever wear this because I haven't been wearing any blue things but last year I've just been adding a lot of blues to my wardrobe I will be bringing this one out again this year um, so the one that I wear a lot last year, I'm going to put them on the back burner a little bit. Not really. Um, <laughs> and then I'm going to bring some of the ones that I haven't worn in a while. So again, this you can find on Neta Forte, I think on Shopbop as well. Again, I think when I get married, the one that I'm going to take to my honeymoon is the one that's going to say something like that. Or you can even get them for your bridesmaid too, I believe. I'm not sure. But again, I really, really, really love this. So that's Caillou and the last one that I have to show you are kind of like very generic also. This one I bought it because I wanted a basket bag again to go to the market and I wanted something that was super casual and I also wanted a basket bag to go buy flowers in the, fla um, in the summertime and I think these are like perfect to buy flowers and then also I think they just make such good decoration just like sitting somewhere in your house I don't know like if your friends come to visit in the summertime and you guys want to go to the market and you just want to carry basket bags or just put on a bicycle and go for like a nice little one I think these are really really cute for that I really really love these I got a medium and a large I believe or a small and a medium and they look the same size to me but um, I really really love these as well I haven't really used these in a while since I've got gotten them these I got from um, from Etsy as well but I just feel like you can skip these I would recommend the one with the strap and the one with the full leather handle instead but if you want those I'll be linking them below as well another one that I have actually I won this bag why is this bag still on them this is actually a designer Eden uh, Monroe actually gifted me this little bag I thought it was like super cute and super chic it's just something to have again I think this is a cute little bag to like dress up and just go out with I really 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 love this and this is a cute little bag to take to like a nice little party especially in the summertime and so on it's just like so perfect and so pretty and really 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 cute also again it could just be looked at as like a decorative object if you really wanted to so and the last bag that I don't have with me that I mentioned is the Bali bag um, I don't know if you ladies remember back in 2016 or 17 when everyone was going to Bali and everyone had the circle bags I wanted one so badly, but then again, I'm like everyone had them and I'm like I didn't want the circle So I ended up going for the rectangle one. I love the rectangle a lot better But um, I don't have it because it's in my um, Aleta, it's in my My suitcase so I will show you a picture of, you know, when I took it to Mexico a couple of times. Uh, I always take it with me every time I go somewhere warm because I do find that is one of the bags that I really, really, really like to wear at night for dinner because it has a strap and then it's more on the dressier side as well. I could just put my phone and my necessities in there and I'm good to go. I also love to wear it just like regularly um like you know in the city just at night when i am going out for dinner with my friends and and stuff like that so i really really love that one again if you love the circle one 
yeah absolutely i think the circle one is a really really great one to have but just like for me personally because everyone had the circle one i just just didn't like it i just didn't think it was practical enough um so i decided to go for the rectangle one this is not necessarily a basket bag but i thought i would show you anyways this is more of like a little flower basket which i think anyone that's kind of has my style which is kind of like that whole romantic i don't know in my head i live somewhere else i live in a different era this is like romantic and cute and all that stuff so that's me in my head this is my picnic blanket over here so i just leave it in here because just make life so much easier so i don't have to look at it um i mean i don't have to look for it so again i got this from etsy it was the last one but there are a ton of um flower basket this is one of the prettiest flower basket out there i love it so much i just love when i go to central park and i bring my flower and then it's just like so pretty to just go to a nice picnic or even sometimes i just love to get lost in the field carry my little flower um i just love it so much so i do think that it's probably something you may want to add to your collection if you love picnics i feel like if you love picnics this is perfect i love picnics i just think this is like so perfect for that i love a beautiful flower basket again also you can create flower arrangement and just have this on like in the middle of your table so it's something to consider i love this so so much and this has been my basket bag collection and also the best basket bags that i think you should probably add to your wardrobe for the summer months let me know which one you will be checking out and let me know which one do you prefer if you prefer the loewe or the chloe basket bag i love them both i wear the loewe a lot a lot more because it's just easier because the chloe one i must say it can get a little heavy after carrying it for a while as opposed to the loewe the loewe is just so light it doesn't matter if i have like you know pounds of things in there it's just never that heavy i love it love it so another tip that i will give you when carrying basket bag last summer as i was carrying my loewe bag i was wearing my favorite white dress from stad and i had a pen in there and the head for the pen fell off and then the pen was inside my loewe basket bag like so and then it was poking out so as the pen was poking out because i was carrying it like this as i was walking like all the pen was scribbling on my dress so i was actually going to meet um, my um partner's friends for like the first time we we're going to this barbecue um and then i got at the train station like we didn't even see that because we were going like somewhere um upstate and then i got to the house my friends um my friend's husband's wife was like what happened to your dress and i'm like what do you mean and then i looked there was the biggest blue patch on my dress so i just could not figure out what it was until later on then i realized it was my pen so because the head came off so be careful when you have a pen make sure it's a pen where the head is not going to come off and also make sure that the pen is on the other side it's not gonna poke it it's not gonna poke through where it's actually scribbling on your dress i was about to salvage the dress because i'll tell you my little secret it's the laundress they have the stain solution so i kind of like put the stain solution with like the ble bleach alternative i left it overnight and then i washed it the next day and it came off and that was after almost six months um i did it recently actually because i didn't think it was going to come off that dress i was so 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 like so sad i was ready to order that dress again from stan because i thought you know what i can't salvage that dress it's done and over with but the stain solution did its thing and i'm so so happy on the first wash like everything came off i was just like so 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 happy so um that is one thing to consider so be mindful when you're carrying your basket bags especially if you're wearing it over your shoulder just make sure like your pen is not poking especially if you're wearing a lot of white dresses so 
that was a little tip there so thank you again so much for watching let me know which basket bag that you will be checking out and if you are a fan and a lover of basket bags as much as i am i love basket bags so much i don't know i've always thought that was such a cd girl the, the only reason why i'm so, not only the only reason why but i think one of the reasons why i love the city so much is because i kind of like grew up in the country so growing up i wanted kind of like the opposite of that but now as i'm getting older i kind of like miss that country life i kind of miss just like waking up and just have like a land or like you know field of like things where i can just go for a walk and so on where i can just like carry my little basket bag and just go pick up flowers in the garden basket bag does to me it kind of like take me back to my childhood you know when i used to go you know to the mountain to just like you know change the goats you know we used to change the animals and so on so i think that's what it is i just love basket bags and um yeah let me know if you love basket bag as much as i do as much as me and let me know which one that you will be checking out and i cannot wait thanks so much for watching i will catch you in my next video bye bye